another Rebel FC match. I am absolutely buzzing for this one. And boy, do we have some pretty interesting opponents. We have got Wanderers FC facing us. And now they are actually five-time FA Cup winners. Keep in mind, this was a very long time ago. And I mean very, very long time ago. Now they won the first ever FA Cup. I mean, that's pretty awesome. So we decided to take them on today. They disbanded and have recently come back from the dead. And we are going to give them a game. So one of the oldest teams playing against one of the newer teams. So we're really excited for this one and also we actually put up a full game over on the Rebel FC channel And that was against one of the best Sunday League sides in the whole of England We decided to test ourselves to the absolute max go watch that link down below But before we do that, let's watch this game because it's a bloody good game Let's see who we've got in the starting 11 in goals We've got Kalen been playing quality lately. So he has made a return now at right back We have got Rambo we then at the two center backs. We've got Casey and Reed and then at left back, you're probably like, where are you, Cal? What are you doing? Unfortunately, my right knee is an absolute shambles. And I'm going to be after taking a few minutes off. But, uh, you know... That's just the way these things go. So the next couple of games, I'll be, I won't be playing as much, but I am on the bench. So in place of me, we have our very own camera shy, Will. And you're probably wondering, why is there a picture of a lemon? Well, like I said, he is camera shy. So now I just get to pick random things that, you know, describe his face. So there you go, Will. You're now officially a lemon. Anyways, moving into the midfield, we're playing 4-3-3. So we've got Lionel and Ali. Ali, absolute magician. Let's see how he gets on in this game. He's trying to get some match fitness back. And since in front of them we have got Sava now moving on to the front three we've got Rayan put in some quality performances lately and coach Saul reckons he should be starting at right wing now onto the striker position we have got Dante he is not naturally a striker he actually naturally plays a DM role but Rory is unfortunately away and he is our only out and out striker so we have that then onto left wing we have Mr. Highlight Reel himself Jamie aka LDN movements aka London movements and uh, by the way I just want to say a bunch of the players actually make YouTube videos they have Instagram I want you to go follow all their social medias and ours too. Links down below. Go check that out. But without further ado, let's get into the game. And here we go. It is kickoff against the five-time FA Cup winners, Wanderers FC. And it is so good to be back. The boys are excited for this game. The changing room is very live. We have Rayan, who has actually turned into our team DJ. Uh, not going to lie, but he, he does have some bangers. But let's crack on with the game as we've got their right winger taking it down. And Casey with an incredible slide tackle there. What a way to start the game. Ball played across. And they get so unlucky. And we get pretty lucky, actually, that they didn't get ahead to that. That could have been very, very dangerous. Good to have Reed back in the team. But we've got our magician, Ali, on the ball right now playing some nice football Dante does a great job good first touch to get it past the player and what can he get and ah uh, it's gone wide he went for the outside of the boot shot and it didn't pay off unfortunately and uh, you can see he's a little bit disappointed with that himself we've got Rambo playing at right back of course and what are we gonna do here he plays it into the middle see if there's any options plays it back and Ali ships it out wide along the left to our makeshift left back Will who's uh, replacing me for today and he manages to get past him plays it through to Jamie what's JB able to do here swings a good ball in unfortunately we didn't have Rory Rory would usually be our guy to get on his head on the end of that but it wasn't meant to be and uh, with Dante he, he just wasn't able to get his head on it so we've got Ali on the ball anyways plays a great ball through to Jamie what can Jamie do here is whizzed across and again no one there on the other end of it a good start though we've got a couple chances and what's this he plays it over the top oh that could have been Rebels best ever goal right there let's take another look at that here we go a great little dink from Dante he goes to whack that and it looks like there was a deflection there and that is out for a corner could you imagine if that went in oh my god that would have definitely been a contender for goal of the season for Rebel uh, a relatively poor ball play him from Rand. I know he'll want to do better next time. And it looks like they're actually on the counter and they're playing over the top through ball here. Rambo is called into action and he plays that back to Kalen. Kalen there scuffs it pretty horribly. We were lucky that attacker didn't take that in his stride. And another great tackle from Casey. For a defender to get into the highlights this early on twice is pretty impressive. So some good work from him. Dante picks out who's this? This looks like it's Sava. Sava's on the run. He's got so much time. He's got so much space. What's he going to do? And he slots that away near post sometimes if you have that much time on your hands you can often overthink it and mess it up the keeper going to be a little bit disappointed with that as it does go into the near post to see here but he's got all the time
time and he makes the right decision and he gets the first goal of the game. Congratulations, Sava. Quality goal and a fantastic run. And also to Dante, who made a, a, just a wonderful ball through there to give him all that time and space. So... It's looking good. Good to get off to a strong start. Rebel are known not to be the best in the first half. We often do a lot better in the second. But this time, Sava again picked out Ray. And what a ball and what a touch as well. And it looks like he's been taken out. But Dante is there with the follow-up. It is beautiful. He puts that away. Dante was very, very gassed to have that one. And let's take another look at this. Dante cleans it up. Hits the inside of the post. And that, my friends, is a goal. Oh, wait. Looks like Dante has something to say to the boys. What did I say? What did I say? <laughs> I said I was going to score, Nico. Yeah, that's right. He did say he was going to score this game. And would you believe it? He's gone and done exactly what he said. But we've still got a game on our hands. It's 2-0. But everyone knows 2-0 is nothing when it comes to these games. A great little uh, sort of step over. Had the team uh, falling over. But Rambo takes no chances and clears that. Which is just needed. Sometimes you just got to get rid of it. No time for messing around at the back. Uh, a ball hit, but Kaelin, that was uh, pretty easy for him. Kaelin now launches the ball all the way out to that left wing. Can we just take a moment to appreciate what a great throw that is? We've got Jamie here absolutely rocketing it down. 100 miles an hour. Put the burners on, son. Takes the right back on his outside. Plays a great ball across. And, ah, oh, Dante was so unlucky there not to be able to hit that first time. Tees up nicely for Sava. Their defender manages to get a block in. And we've got Will here, our left back. What's he going to do? Plays a 1-2. It's Dante, a great ball. He whacks that, and oh my god, he hits the inside of the post. Let's take another look at that. Replay, please. One, two, bang. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I had the keeper beat and everything. What a, that would have been an amazing goal. Let's take another look. It really was the inside of there. But anyways, Lionel, so, so good. He manages to do his job at the end. Oh my god, wait. Did Seven just send that guy to the shops? Jeez, that was nasty. And as you can see, again, the player's quick feet and a good dribbling means we have managed to pick up a, another foul. This time, it uh, looks like Sav is going to get on this. And uh, we've yet to have a free kick goal. He swings out on the top and it's in the crossbar. You've got to be having a laugh. No one's there on the rebound. When will we get our first free kick goal? I do not know. But here, let's take another look. Replay, boom, it's dipping, it's dipping. He has the keeper beat and he just... It was so, so close. The team were gutted. We're still waiting for that first free kick goal. But regardless, Ali on the ball plays it out wide. And we've got Will making a great overlapping run. Jamie plays it inside. He's gone again. And once again, the quickness of the players draws another foul. And it looks like Dante wants his ray and quickly goes out like, come on, man, give me the ball. Dante's like, not a chance. A little, maybe even a Neymar Cavani situation there, but for free kick. So let's see. There's a lot of space on that left side of the goal. Boom. Oh. Unlucky there, and you can see he's disappointed with that. You know, he should have been testing it, at least getting it on target. Uh, but these things happen. It had a good bit of whippage on it, though. So, fair play to him for that. Now, we've got Jamie on this left wing here. What's he going to be able to do? The classic fake shot. So let's see what he can do. Plays it inside there. It's Dante. I think Lionel tried to play the one-two there, but fortunately for them, one of their players got a little touch to it. And that was about to be nasty. So, here we go. It's another free game. This from a little bit further out. You can't really test the keeper. But we're still going to have Sava go for it, as you do. I mean, we just really want that free kick goal, it seems. But it wasn't meant to be, and Sava knows it there. As he rockets that one right over the top. Anyways, Lionel tries to play it out wide. Gets it out to Wills. Wills plays it back inside to Lionel. He turns very nicely. Opens up some space. And, oh, Sava tried to leave that there for, I believe, Dante. But he just didn't quite read that properly. And it wasn't meant to be. Now, they have a great opportunity here. They're trying to stay onside. It looks like their right wing was onside. But he's not able to get to the ball. And that could have been really, really worrying for us. But uh, not this time. Not today, people. And Ali here, too, in his defensive duties. A great ball played in. A lofted one at that. Gives him plenty of time to get underneath it. And it's a bit of a shambles from us. We don't really have great shape. But Lionel does a good job of pushing off their player and plays through. What are we going to get here? Ah! Oh, would you look at that? They've called offside. And I believe that is the correct call. Let's take a look. Yep. There it is. Dante offside. I think he was actually expecting it just a little bit earlier. Uh, that way, it would have been onside, but Sava couldn't get it quite away from his feet that quickly. So, let that be that. A great ball played over the top, all the way to the left. We like to play through the middle, but not today. A flip flat gets Jamie past him. What's he going to do? He's got another defender in his way. He takes it past him. Can he get it across? Oh, almost. Some great play down that left side, and unfortunately, he wasn't able to get it across. Short corner played. We've got Will here. What's he going to do? He plays it out to the top. This is Dante. Dante written all over it. Wax that. But unfortunately, just sails over the crossbar. Only a few inches in that one. 
We do have ourselves a corner, though. Again, it's played to the near post, and none of our players able to get on the other end of it. A little bit disappointing there. Two corners, and we really haven't tested their keeper. So that is that. Anyways, it's halftime, guys. Very happy with the first half result. You can see the boys are happy. High five and Ali and Casey there. You can see uh, Rambo is currently gassing up Sava because of uh, his goal. He'd be happy with that. We're going into the changing room with high spirit and uh, seeing what sort of feedback we can get from Coach Saul as well. Okay, lads. You all right? So, quickly, well done. Great half of football, all right? We say come out quickly. All came out quick. Really impressed, right? Now you just gotta see the job through. All right, well done. Keep it, let's keep it solid at the back. Midfield, keep playing through. Sav, try and find them pockets, keep going. All right, deal. Jay, stay high and wide. Stand to up top, and then we're gonna make some more changes around here, all right? Let's go, well done. Get a little break. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right, so it's the second half, and we must continue. Instantly, Dylan is on the pitch. He was absolutely buzzing to be back on the pitch. He started on the bench, and uh, to those of you who don't know, Dylan and Dante are brothers, and when they're both on the pitch, they can they can they can make some, for some really exciting plays. So I look forward to seeing that. We also have James that has, has come on, and I also came on at left back as Reed managed to injure himself in the changing room. I'm not, I'm not actually joking. So uh, I was supposed to only be playing sort of 20 minutes, but um, so be it. That, that's just the way these things happen. Reeve, you know, injured in the change room. We have to keep this 2-0 cushion or we're going to be under some trouble. So a great header there. And it's actually a goal. It's been played in and Casey is really trying for this top goal scorer. I am not joking. Now, you look at this, yeah. Look at it. He just, he, he reads it perfectly. And you know what? It's a slow header, but it's one of those really awkward ones for a keeper to try and say because it bounces at such an awkward height that, you know, I can't really blame the keeper. And you know what? Fair play to Casey. He got his head down got the ball down on the ground and we can see Rambo backing up playing nice high and wide and uh, comfortable at the back at the minute but yes I'm on I'm on at left back you can see me way out in the corner there um, but we got James on the ball now he's gonna be playing it through inside boom outside what's he gonna do he's done such a good job but there's no one there to help him out he tried to play it through to Jamie but the ball just wasn't quite good enough he didn't really have many options there and he had a nice little run too anyways we crack on. It's a good one. And he goes for goal. No, didn't really. It wasn't on target. Keeper had that covered. Easy peasy. Just want to remind you guys as well. We've got a full game on the Rebel channel. Go check that out. Uh, by the way, Kaylin does a really good job to hold that down. But um, yes, uh, go check that out. The Rebel channel will be linked down below along with all of our social media. Follow that stuff, people. Because uh, yeah, we play the best Sunday league side or one of the best at least in England. So go watch that. Well, I say that as Jamie does a fantastic job. Savas breaking his ass to get in there and it wasn't meant to be unfortunately jamie couldn't pick him out i don't think lionel realized that there was a player right there because he sort of opened it up and made it easy for the challenge but he'd been putting in a good shift the goalkeeper does it does a bit of a weird uh, goal kick there and unfortunately none of their players would get a hold of it but there we go dylan lets the ball run very nicely great little footwork from rambo as he back heals it there it's gonna what's he gonna do is he gonna play this in he whips it in it's a great ball and we got ray in there peels off the defender and oh that would have been some big Beautiful football there between Dylan, Rambo, and then Rambo's great ball into Rayan. Some quality stuff, but unfortunately, we weren't able to get that final end product. They should be happy with that, though. That's the football we like playing. And boom! What is a game without a big Rambo tackle? Let's take another look at that. Give me a replay on that, please. we got two players here. Dill jumps out, and Rambo almost like sort of tackles our own player, but it looked like a pretty decent tackle to me. I don't see anything too much wrong with it. And they chip it over. They're trying to play some good football here, and now we're trying to get on the counter. What is good? gonna happen here he tries to play a threaded through ball and it's there it's Dante but he's been called for offside the linesman is absolutely sure of it let's take a look and I'm sorry but that to me looks like he is on side and uh, Dante had just changed his run admittedly it was quite quick but you know these things happen sometimes you don't get, always get the correct decision I'm a little bit disappointed because Dante was 100% through on goal and he could have potentially had himself a second goal for the game Anyways, we give away a free kick. A little bit nerve-wracking. We need to work on our set pieces, so let's see what they can do here. Number four is about a swing and a ball over. Actually, it deflects off one of our players, and Kalen reacts nicely. He's not the tallest keeper, so um, you can sort of see... You can see why he was a little bit worried and that's why he had to jump and make, make, make a good save out of it too. A corner played in and it's all over the shot. What are they able to do? Are they able to get a goal out of this? We got it out on the wing. It looks like he sort of messes that up. We got Dylan absolutely pacing out here. You see, look at my legs, man. Look at the giraffe on ice. He's, the left back is cruising. And what does he do? He pulls it back. I'm like, okay, okay. I could get a header here. Oh, wait, it's chipped into me. What's going to happen? I chest it out. Bang! Oh, no way. I couldn't believe that, man. I was so good. You can see that. I was 
like, I'm sorry. It was a fantastic opportunity. I do a good job. Chest down nicely, but I just take it a little too early. And I won't lie to you, it was honestly a whisker away from going in. And that would have been quality. But their goalkeeper there, not the best to kick outs again. And, uh, you know, what? Well, Kalen's had a scuff one. It looks like their, their keeper had a scuff one. I don't know what was going on. Casey now playing in the defensive midfield role. He's been moved up into there. And uh, he had a, a lot of time there to play around. Surprisingly, no one made a challenge. And uh, they have a deflection. And that goes out for a corner. So good football so far. I'm happy with the football that we're playing. James has come on, really added a bit of a dynamic. Now we have James and uh, Casey playing sort of like that deep line. But we still have Ali, who's had a quality game. A really, really good game. And he picks out Rayan. And oh my god. Now that to me is just such a quality goal. You had two players. And I think you'll see. Watch it. Look at it, how he picks that out beautifully. A great run from Rayan. And uh, Rayan, sorry. And a really good ball from Ali, who has just played magnificently. And you'll see in a second that the boys run over to Ali and just appreciate that assist. That is some quality vision. There it is. Hello, lad. Reeve comes up from center back to just give him a big old hug to be like, thank you very much, Ali. Quality game. He's really controlled that midfield in this game as well. He's played really, really well. And it's great when he's around. He's still trying to get his match fitness. Um, a lot of the times he's only able to play sort of 40 minutes. But this game he's played a lot of minutes. And he's really put in a shift. So we can't wait for him to be full match fit. Fit. Very exciting. A bit sloppy from us at the back. We keep trying to work it out. And a couple of errors there mean they get the possession in a pretty dangerous area. But again, we got Dylan here on the ball. What's he trying to do? What can he do? Can he get past these two players? A great ball played through to Casey, who is now at DM. A great ball over the top. It's Rayan. He's one on one. Is he going to get a second for the game? Oh, he chips him. No. Oh, Rayan. No way, mate. He's fuming. He kicks the ball against the back there. He gives a cheeky smile. He knows that he's getting rinsed on the bench for missing that one-on-one. -on -one. You can't be missing those. A nutmeg there from Dylan. And wait, that was the second one. Are we going to give him that? I don't know. I'm not too sure about that. Uh, but again, good ball from them. They've got a good attacking opportunity here. They're actually a, a good team. You know, this was a solid team. And uh, they unfortunately just didn't have that last bit to get the goal. There was a claim for handball there. Thought that would have been a little bit hard. His hands were sort of down by the side. But uh, sometimes referees can give those, so it wouldn't have surprised me either. Um, a ball played through there. Rayan, unfortunately, not able to get on the end of that. But the boys have been playing very, very well. We're in the 90th minute. It's 4-0. And it looks like that is going to be full-time full for the Rebellion. Yes. Anyways, very happy with that. Let us know. What did you guys think to the game? Give us lots of feedback down in the comments. Who do you think was good? What do you think to Will, the guy who replaced me for left back for a lot of the game? I thought he had a quality game. Ali was very impressive. Rayon got himself a goal. Um, but yeah, all round quality. One thing I do want to say, guys, is a lot of these guys actually make their own YouTube content. And I'd love it if you guys could go follow them. We always leave their links in the description. You obviously have Casey makes videos. Sava on your screen. He makes videos. We've also got Ali, who just jumped in. He makes some hilarious one. KGK, our goalkeeper, Kalen who with a big smile there, he makes videos. All their links are down below and it would just mean so much to me if you guys could go and check that out. Another little thing I wanna say is Wanderers have asked me to tell you guys that they're actually looking for some new players. And if you live in the south of London, then please click the link in the description. Go check that out. Um, they would really, really appreciate that. So thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you have a fantastic day. Again, follow Rebel on all social medias. I can't stress that enough. Have a fantastic day and I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye-bye.